so going back to find a bottle of wine. And, and here we have the view from the Taj Mahal. And there we have Hedja in the Taj Mahal. This is great, man. Except for the fact that you don't have toilets or oh, showers. I'll be right. Okay, cool. It's so hot. It's like 35 degrees. It's like 8 o'clock. I'm actually boiling. <laughs> Okay, okay. What I signed up for? Get away. So basically, I have to uh, pee in the river, brush my teeth in the river, wash my face in the river, um, take a bath in the river. So r the river is pretty much my life. Um, the next three days. Um, yeah. Oh, I'm dead. I'm, I'm, I'm. Morning. It's day two, and the weather isn't that great. Um, I think it might only be twenty degrees, and it's like really cloudy. It's sprinkling with rain a bit, but that's alright, at least it's not like boiling hot. You know, you really take toilets for, like, for granted when you don't have a toilet for a day. I, I just really miss my toilet. <laughs> but yeah, I'm only wearing this hat because I didn't bring my night serum. So my skin looks like crepamole, which is really nice. Yay! Yeah, I don't know what we're doing today. Might just go for a swim in the river. The water's really nice. So the time is nine o'clock. Probably a bit past nine, but.
Sun's come up, which is really nice. Um, yeah, wasn't really feeling it this morning, but I love the sun. So this is nice. I'm just, yeah, you know, getting some sun, my towel, doing my art assignment. Because, yeah, I don't know why. I just felt like it. So I just finished it, which is nice. It's really hot though. So, I don't know. Here's my crib. I am TV. Welcome to my crib. <laughs> I don't know if you can see me or if it's like really bad lighting, but. Hmm. See, the thing about camping is that it's all about relaxing and stuff. I like not thinking about all the stuff you have to do. I just get so restless so quick because I'm just constantly thinking about all the stuff that I have to do that I haven't done yet like I'm just thinking why am I here I could be doing so much other stuff I have two assignments to do this weekend and I get back on Sunday and I'm like uh, I mean I'm nearly finished one of them but still oh and I have four I have four days of workouts to catch up on when I get back on Sunday because I have to do like four workouts on Sunday which is pretty much impossible because I can't do them next week because next week is like a new week of workouts so just you know I just can't really relax and stuff but I'll try Morning, it's day three. It's freezing, so I'm wearing this hoodie and long pants. And yeah, I didn't really get any sleep last night because I don't know the people next to us were blasting music at 2 a.m., which is nice. Thank you. Uh, I was, yeah, my hair's greasy. My skin looks like shit. And I don't know, I just don't think um, the camping, the raw, rough camping vibes are for me. But you know, it's an experience. I just kind of want to go home to my own bed. But it's the last day. I have one sleep, we have like one sleep left. So oh, we're leaving tomorrow morning, afternoon ish. Noon. I don't know. We'll see.
just an update it's now raining it's been raining for a while it's not too bad but it's just kind of annoying because you can't do anything and it's really cold so i had to put my my shoes on and just really you know ready for, for fashion week it's so cold though like i'm freezing the time is it's probably like it might be 12 maybe it's 1 maybe it's 11 I don't know anyway yeah it's raining it's not very fun I finished reading my book that I started yesterday could start reading another one but I don't really feel like it oh the rain's getting heavy on well, update you later. Probably sounds like I absolutely hate camping, which isn't the case. Um, it's just the fact that I, like I grew up with going to big cities in the world and stuff. And camping like this is just really different from what I'm used to. And I don't hate it at all and no one forced me to go. I chose to go because um, my host parents love it and I just like I wanted to experience what they do like when they go on holidays and stuff and it's just not me like it's not bad it's not a bad experience it's a really good experience because sometimes you just gotta say hey why not like I would just be spending my weekend reading watching YouTube videos, doing workouts, if I haven't gone, but now I'm here and I'm experiencing something different and to be honest I probably wouldn't go again because uh, it's just not me but some people love it like my host family and they've been doing it for most of their life and that's great like different people like different things I just really like being on the go all the time like walking through like walking, yeah, I don't know, in big cities, visiting big cities, and like as many tourist sites as you possibly can in a day. And you, you like you walk around till your legs ache and you have blisters all over your feet. That's just what I like. I just can't really with all this like relaxing stuff. But again, different people like different things, and that's completely fine. And this is a great experience because now I know um, what they like to do. Just as relaxing and I know that I probably wouldn't want to go camping without a toilet or a shower again. And I think that's completely fine. Like that's camping is their thing. They love it. And they probably don't, well I don't know if they do but they probably don't like going to big cities as much as I do like that's my kind of thing and their thing is camping and that's fine one thing I do like about camping though is um like I haven't looked at myself in a mirror since Thursday so like I don't know what I look like and I like that you aren't constantly reminded of how shit you look <laughs> and I've been wearing my PJs all day and I've gotten away with it I mean everyone looks like shit to be honest and no one gives a damn